What's going on, Snipers? My name is here. I hope all of you guys are having a wonderful day today. Let's just dive right into our daily cryptocurrency analytics for today and talk about Tron and why I think over 2018 we're going to see some extensive price movements heading upwards and why I think the market cap will continue to grow heading into the next couple of weeks. So let's just dive right into it. So for those of you that are new to the channel, I'm going to be keeping things a lot more simpler for this video here. I'm going to be drawing out some support levels here. We see some support right around 998 Satoshis, and we're seeing some resistance right around 1456 before the breakout. If you guys are Patreons, you know I did predict this today. I have a trade alert set up for any of you guys that are Patreons. The link is in the description below. A lot of you guys have asked me about that, but I pretty much posted this today, and I said that I saw it testing the resistance a couple times, and at that point, I had figured that if it is testing resistance like that, it it may potentially break out once again and see some new all-time highs. So we went ahead and predicted that. Hopefully some of you guys were able to gain from that. I get a ton of questions about the new tier system. So we did upgrade the tier system, guys. We now have silver, gold, ruby, sapphire, emerald, and diamond tiers. You guys can actually just look at the link in the description if you guys want to look more into that. But our sapphire tier actually has podcast recordings of all our live calls, night owls, and exclusive on-the-go knowledge that I'm going to be posting on the Patreon. So that's actually one of the most popular that we're seeing now. And that's just a little heads up for those of you that have asked about about that but looking at this technical chart i am going to be pulling up a couple different indicators here and i will explain each and every one of them we're going to be pulling up the moving average exponential or the ema which stands for the exponential moving average we'll also pull up the rsi the relative strength index and the volume just to keep things pretty simple here you can see we're seeing some extensive buy volume here with these green charts and the red represents sell volume of course rsi here right over 70 at this point uh showing signs of being overbought if something's over 70 with rsi which is this purple chart right here it typically means something's overbought and prices are going to most likely consolidate for the short term uh it's something that a lot of day traders and swing traders like to utilize and i am currently looking to make a position in trx i wasn't able to get my position in yet and i actually did a little bit of a position right over here as i called it out and it broke out so i am looking to get another position into tron and continue to add more um, being the fact that i've done some research on it and that's what i'm making this video for to tell you guys exactly what i found and what i think uh tron is going to do once again this is my opinion nobody else's you don't have to take this to heart this is just a perspective and as you guys know in this community i want you guys to just have as many perspectives as possible so hopefully this will help you guys out and hopefully some of you guys were able to gain off of the patreon trade alert that we posted uh, but what i expect here you can never determine price magnitude or price levels so once again you cannot determine how far this will go up it's all based upon the demand that uh, incurs however you can obviously determine price movement let me teach you guys something so the ema right here is this blue line it stands for the exponential moving average there's typically three ways you can look at this if if the candlesticks are on top and overlapping um, that's not necessarily a sign of any sort of price movements negative or positive it's under the ema that's a negative price movement and then if it is bouncing on top that's a sign of positive price movement so you can see it bounced on top once twice and then finally popped right on top this was a sign right here that it was trending upwards and the trend line was going to be created now you can see we're way and above the ema so we'll see how far this breakout incurs until it finds a little bit of consolidation like um, most of the time so that's what we're seeing with tron now i think over 2018 there's going to be some extensive growth here let's look at the cryptocurrency coin market cap it's a little bit different today right you see this little tron thing here Where, what is this doing here well yes it has made its way past stellar litecoin and iota into the number seven spot on its way to pass nem and cardano cardano is going to be a little bit tougher that's more than double its market cap but nem may uh quite possibly be uh beat at this point looking at tron at 107 percent over the 24 hour change if you guys look here it is one of the highest so far um, today so if you guys want to look at more of the fundamentals this was all technical i'm going to transition into more fundamental analysis i do want to mention this though market cap is heading towards a trillion i believe we'll see a trillion before at least february of 2018 depending on how the market fluctuates until then but i definitely can see this incurring a lot more of a larger market cap with a lot of these coins gaining momentum and i believe tron will be one of those based on the research that i've done and once again I am going to be using different sources like Twitter, and I think Twitter is a great resource because I'm getting it from the actual founder of Tron, the CEO of Tron, not necessarily somebody that's just tweeting about it. So don't criticize the Twitter resource. If you don't like that, then I'm sorry. Um, but I like to use Twitter as a way of almost looking at a decentralized social media platform because not necessarily decentralized in its mechanics, but decentralized in the fact that you're hearing from the actual 
authors and creators and developers like when President Trump was in the election, he was getting a lot more favorites, a lot more retweets than Hillary on Twitter. But if you looked at the traditional news, it was all about Trump maybe most likely going to lose. And then obviously that didn't happen. So if you would have followed Twitter rather than the traditional news, you would have had a little bit of a better odd at guessing who was going to win the election. Uh, not that I'm biased with either, but I think Twitter is a great resource. And I hope you guys can agree. I think it's a great news resource. But first and foremost, you guys know I talk about the team a lot. And Justin Sun, the CEO of Tron is uh, an individual that has intrigued me quite a bit. He's not just a normal individual just starting an ICO. I want, you, I want to re read this real quick to some of you guys. So Tron is the brainchild of Justin Sun, a 26-year-old Chinese entrepreneur who has made it to the Forbes 30 under 30 list twice. So obviously he's had some prior success. And what do I look for when I'm looking at a, an ICO or a coin to invest in is prior success for the most part, because that can be a predictor for future success, right? He's the former chief representative of, Rip, of Ripple. I think this has led to a lot of the run-up we've seen over the past couple of days. Um, similar to Stellar, how that's a fork of Ripple. I think being that this is affiliated with Ripple in some way, shape or form, being that he was a chief representative, it could have had a Strong, uh, a small influence or maybe even a strong influence on the price movement we've seen over the past couple of days. So he um, was the former chief representative of Ripple in Greater China and CEO of Paywo, which is a leading auto audio content community in China. In 2015, Justin also became the only millennial attendee of Hupon University founded by Jack Ma. Jack Ma actually started Alibaba, one of the most successful entrepreneurs in the world, in my opinion. What an inspiration. If you guys have ever watched the video by Jack Ma, extremely motivating and inspirational. I don't like saying motivating. I like saying inspirational because motivation is temporary. Inspiration is permanent. That's something my mentor taught me. Um, so chairman of Alibaba. So he's well known as a protege of Jack Ma. And once again, guys, what's interesting is he's actually partnered up with somebody from Alibaba as well. One more senior developer from Alibaba just joined Tron. So from the team aspect, I'm not going to get into all the depth. You guys can read the white, white paper. There's too many videos of people explaining all the stuff that you could just read. But I want you guys to get my perspective on it because I think a perspective can help a lot more than just the logic and technical aspects of things because anybody can get that information. But not everybody can get uh, different perspectives because that's what leads to this collaborative intelligence. And that's a form of super intelligence. It's collaborating with as many people as possible, which in my opinion, you just can't do in a local area. You really have to expand yourself and look at other means. And that's why I think we have such a strong discord community. If you guys don't know, we have this discord open for all of you guys. It's a free resource that we've developed for our snipers. And pretty much what you can do here is go through, you can talk about Tron. We have a whole Tron chat. I was actually on there earlier today, as you can see, just chatting back and forth with some of the people, but we are just constantly looking at new charts. You guys can actually go to breakouts here, look at different potential breakouts that are incurring. Obviously this is not trading advice. However, it's all different perspectives that you guys can utilize. Once again, we also have a trading one-on-one area, a resources tab for all of my favorite crypto resources. This is a free resource open for you guys. Go out, open up discord. There's a mobile version, a web version, a desktop version. I highly encourage you guys to do that. It's going to help out. Trust me. It's all about having that collaborative intelligence. We just hit over 14,000 members on discord and I am extremely, uh, not, not, I'm not going to say, you know, surprised, but I'm humbled at the fact that we have so much uh, of you guys coming into the community and contributing and engaging. And I thank God every single day that I have the opportunity to be a part of this guys. So let me just pull up a couple different things that have led me to really have a belief system in Tron. I've done a lot of my research, but I'm only going to show you guys the generalities, things that I think can matter to you guys. So let's go straight to Justin's mouth, right? This is stuff that he said from his mouth. This is coming out of his mouth. None of this is news. Uh, and I want to talk about his visionary approach to leading Tron. And I think uh, having a leader that has a vision is so important in this market, being that this is the new dot-com revolution. You need the Steve Jobs. You need the Bill Gates. You need the Mark Zuckerbergs of crypto. And I think Justin Sun is truly creating his own path into becoming one of the most greatest entrepreneurs in cryptocurrency, if not the world, because I think cryptocurrency, but more importantly, blockchain technology and the distributed ledger is going to take over a lot of different industries. And I know a lot of you guys know my belief on that. We'll talk more about that in tonight's Night Owl after the live stream. But let's look at this. So we will announce our partnership with a very prestigious public listed company next week. Looking forward to it. So obviously, there is some potential news coming that is going to increase the attention coming towards Tron. According to CoinMarketCap, daily trading volume Tron ranks top six cryptocurrency. We will learn more from the pioneers like Bitcoin and achieve our web 4.0 genes. Here's what's interesting about this. This was posted on January 2nd. Today is January 4th. And this is 
now when Tron has worked its way to number seven on coin market cap. So that right there can show you guys how you can utilize volume to understand where a coin might be in the next couple of days. It's just another indicator, another technical aspect of a coin that can be utilized to predict future price movements. So in this case, Tron was number six at this you know time, which was January 2nd, with volume. So obviously that was an indicator, that, hey, this may start rising in price. So those of you watching the uh, volume could have done it. I missed it just because I've been so busy with the YouTube channel, but um, obviously a lot of you guys are, are working towards that. Another one I liked, obviously you guys know about CryptoKitties with Ethereum. It takes up a ton of its uh, blockchain network capabilities uh, and clogs it up. But now he's looking to create this for dogs, right? I think some people might see this as corny. I think this is ingenious. My mentor taught me this. He said, Naeem, the things that I did in school and got in trouble for are the same exact things that has turned me into a multimillionaire. Copying other people, talking to other people, and networking. He said, those are the three things that I used to get in disciplinary trouble for, for insubordination and so forth in school. But in reality, that's what makes you a very successful individual, or in this case, a very successful company, because copying is fine. Microsoft copied Apple, Apple copied Microsoft, right? There's this huge debate. Or McDonald's copied Burger King and Wendy's and, and so forth. Like, you can go on and on and on, but Think about a franchise in general. It's just a copy of the same store that started. Copy, copy, copy. So copying is not necessarily a bad thing in business. So I think this is really cool. And then if we look at this last tweet that I want to show you guys, he talks about um, Ripple. And I like this because he had some affiliation with Ripple. He was a former chief representative. But at this point, he's actually now, you know, <laughs> talking uh, good about Ripple, which is not necessarily something that's common in today's world you know people don't talk good anymore a lot of people just like to bash something or just not share their opinion and i like that he says huge congrats to ripple when xrp is you know um this price we never thought it would achieve two dollars 85 cents in just three years tron will follow the miracle of ripple obviously he has to put that tron in there too but uh, i think that's cool that he's still supporting ripple he's supporting the cryptocurrency market and in my opinion, that shows you a leader that's capable of leading the revolution, especially at his age. He has a lot of time to develop and become a better version of himself. With that being said, guys, if you want to buy Tron, it is available on Binance. I'm going to be purchasing uh, some positions in the next couple of hours and days, depending on how price movements work. You guys can just tune into our live streams. You can see it's still the highest volume here in Binance. This is one of my favorite exchanges. I'll put a link in the description for Binance so you guys can actually get that. If you want to use Binance to uh, purchase, you can transfer your, uh, your Bitcoin here, Ethereum, whatever. Um, and then you also have USDT here if you ever need to liquidate and hold um, something as a hedge against Bitcoin or whatever coin you're trading. But anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Once again, if you guys are patrons, uh, we are going to be sending out these trade alerts and we are starting to send out all of our recordings. And I hope to see you guys all on Discord tonight for the live stream. Once again, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time, snipers out.